Alright, budget magic time. Mono white angels in standard. And a little risky, but we'll keep this. We want another white source for our Knight of the White Orchid, but hopefully Thraben Inspector cracking the clue will get us there. Evolving Wilds for our opponent. Well, Plains Thraben Inspector. Pass the turn. Opponent cracks Evolving Wilds. Gets a forest. Lots of forests. Oh man, is this ramp? Oh god. Well, it could be like... Okay, it's not ramp, so that's good at least. Swamp. Let's get in with Thraben Inspector. Play... Majoring that. No! That was a bit of a mistake. Alright, pass the turn. I should have played Plains there. So it's going to keep us from playing our Knight of the White Orchid. Sylvan Advocate for our opponent. Well, let's crack our clue. Well, I guess our Knight of the White Orchid wasn't going to do anything anyway. So let's just Plains and Eldrazi Displacer. Pass the turn. Evolving Wilds for our opponent. And passes. Um. Hmm. Well, let's attack with Displacer. Play... Thraben Inspector. And pass the turn. Opponent cracks Evolving Wilds. Yeah, it's a Swamp. There's a Nissa. Okay. Gets a Forest. Plays the Forest. And gets in 4 2. Well, let's crack our clue. Hopefully, get a land. <laughs> Another Mage Ring Network. That's actually okay. Oh, and a Plains. Um, interesting. Well, let's Knight of the White Orchid get a Plains. Play Plains and just pass the turn. We can start blinking things if we need to. Tireless Tracker for our opponent. There's the land. Gets a clue. Now let's just blink Thraben Inspector. Get a clue. Uh, probably don't want to Linvala yet. So let's Majoring Network and just pass the turn. Opponent cracks their clue, pumps up Tireless Tracker, draws a card. Land, gets a clue. Ruinous Path on our Displacer. Well, let's... Let's blink Sylvan Advocate. And then... Jeez, I should have just hollowed Moonlight there as removal. That was a mistake. Blink Tireless Tracker. Lose our Displacer. Definitely a mistake on my part. Ultimate price on the night. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Maybe we just quarantine field here. Yeah, that's quarantine field. Quarantine field X2. Get rid of Nissa and Tireless Tracker. Battlefield Forge, pass the turn. 
Oh, I'm still kicking myself. Definitely the right play there was Blink and Hollowed Moonlight. Tireless Tracker, again. Land gets a clue. Opponent attacks. Uh, we're going to take it for now. Opponent passes. Planes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, let's. Archangel of Tithes. Land. Knight of the White Orchid. Pass the turn. Cracks the clue. That tireless tracker is pretty annoying. Cracks another clue. Obnixilis reignited. Going to kill our Archangel of Tithes. Plays a land, gets a clue. Well, let's just chump. And eh, actually, that doesn't work. Hmm. I was trying to get our Linvala turned on. I guess we can double chump and take four. Is that worth it? Yeah, I guess that's fine. Actually, that doesn't even work either. Oh my goodness! Punt City. Well, let's crack the clue. Another displacer would be helpful. Well, let's pacify Sylvan Advocate. Attack on Nixilis. Play the planes. Archangel of Tithes. Pass the turn. Cracks the clue, draws a card. Nissa gets a land, gonna flip the Nissa. Man, a Wrath would have been nice at some point. Plays the land, gets a clue, flips the Nissa into Planeswalker Nissa. Tireless Tracker, driving me crazy. Gets an Oath of Nissa. Plays the Oath of Nissa. Gets an Evolving Wilds. Problem is, we're gonna have to chump with Archangel of Tithes, which is pretty bad. Alright, they just play a Morph. Well, now we don't have to chump at least. And they don't even attack? Alright, let's, uh, store up some mana. On Majoring. We draw another Pacifism. Uh, that's not bad. What does Den Protector get back? A removal spell of some kind? Alright, let's attack Nissa. Attack Nissa. Opponent just takes it? Wow, that was unexpected. They're really fighting hard to keep us from getting full value out of this Linvala. Well, let's pacify Tireless Tracker. Can we die next turn? Three, four, five, six, seven? All right, let's pass and take our chances that we don't die. Flips Den Protector. Gets back Obnixilis. Plays Obnixilis. Kills Archangel of Tithes. Gets in a 4 3. And another Tireless Tracker. Ugh. And another land. Tireless Tracker has drawn our opponent so many cards. Alright, let's cycle Hollowed Moonlight. Planes we don't really want. Store up some mana. 
Store up some mana. Interesting. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, you don't have enough mana for both. How do we stay alive? Oh, decisions, decisions. So we can Amiria Shepherd, play the planes, get back Eldrazi Displacer, Blink, Tireless Tracker, kill Obnixilis. We can also just Linvala and hope. Yeah, let's Linvala. I think this has got to be the right play. So we just Linvala. Get a token. Gain back some life. Pass the turn. The next turn, we can potentially Amiria Shepherd get back Linvala? Something along those lines? And then kill Obnixilis? Draws again with Obnixilis. Hissing Quagmire gets some clues. They've just drawn so many cards, and we have not found a Wrath. A Wrath would have been so good. Fires up Hissing Quagmire. Goes attacking. Well, let's block Hissing Quagmire. Call it a day. Crags a clue. Gets a counter. Cracks a clue. Gets some counters. So many cards being drawn. Down to six. Let's store up some mana. Ooh, and a tragic arrogance. This could be a really good turn. So let's... Attack Obnixilis, attack our opponent. They have a Grasp of Darkness, alright. Annoying. Well, that changes the plan ever so slightly. In that case, I think we just... Oh, I really need to kill that Obnixilis. Well, Amiria Shepherd. Play the planes. Let's just get back Linvala. Get another token, gain some more life. Pass the turn. If we could have killed Obnixilis, we could have Tragic Arrogance as well, which would have been insane. Opponent searches out Dragonlord Slumgar. Kills Linvala. Can they kill us? Hopefully not. Dragonlord Slumgar steals Amiria Shepherd. Oh my goodness, this tragic arrogance is going to be so good. Opponent swings with everything. We block Tireless Tracker with our Angel. Oh my goodness, because it's creatures you control. Oh, watch this. <laughs> Put a storage counter on Majoring Network. And the planes, oh god. So let me read this again. For each player, choose among them a permanent that player controls an artifact, creature, and then they sacrifice all the other ones. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five. Tragic arrogance. Our opponent gets to keep Amiria. Oath of Nyssa, and a clue, we keep uh, Quarantine Field and Night. <laughs> and then we get back our Amiria, and then we play a Plains, which gets us back... Um. Let's just get back Eldrazi Displacer. I think that's fine. Get in with our knight. 
pass the turn. Another Obnixilis, sure. Swamp. Kalitas. How many lands do they have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Well, I guess we get a free land. I think. If I counted properly. Yep, get a planes. Which gets back, and our opponent scoops it up! <laughs> yes! The combo! How did we win that game? How did we win that game? <laughs> that was so good! The synergy! I didn't even realize this synergy was in the deck, necessarily. The blink, get back the planes with Amiria Shepard, get back something else. Oh my god. That was awesome. That was that was so good. Oh lord, that was good. Well, in this matchup we might want Descent Upon the Sinful to go along with Tragic Arrogance. I wouldn't be surprised if they were bringing in Discard. And then go down Hedron Archive and maybe go down A Pacifism. I guess maybe we want another Stasis Snare too since it actually gets rid of like a tireless tracker instead of just keeping it from attacking. Let's try it like that. That was a crazy game. Whether or not we win this match, that game was insane. Uh, all right, we got some mana production. Valving Wilds cracked. Gets a swamp. Well, let's just planes go. You have my coast and Sylvan Advocate. Well, Majoring Network, go. Opponent gets in 4 2 with Sylvan Advocate. And passes. Alright, we start storing up mana. Um, Planes, go. Transgress, alright, let's, uh, Stasis Snare, get rid of Sylvan Advocate. Takes our one actual threat. Well, we get a three-man inspector. And... I guess just another planes for now. Pass the turn. Alright, we lose our Descend Upon the Sinful by the looks. Yep. Well, crack the clue, get a planes... We are kind of the opposite of our opponent. <laughs> well, we might as well play this knight. It's never going to do anything at this point. We're so many lands up. Opponent gets a land. And a Nissa for another land. Well, let's start storing. Get in with our knight. Planes and pass the turn. There's Tireless Tracker. And a clue token. Opponent gets in a 4 2. Well, let's store some mana. Store some mana. Cycle Hollow Moonlight. Oh lord. Flooding. Well, pacify tireless tracker. Attack with both. Battlefield Forge. Pass the turn. Oh, we've drawn way too many lands and way too few spells. That's the one thing I don't especially like about this deck is we don't have a very good source of card advantage. We kinda do, like blinking, Thraben Inspector and stuff, but we gotta go pretty deep to get card advantage. Opponent finds their fifth land, which could mean Obnixilis. And looks like it does. Conclave Naturalist. Alright. Gets rid of our stasis. Oh, gets rid of the pacifism. 
Interesting. Well, we're going to need a Wrath here at some point. Let's store up some mana. Store up some mana. Drop down to 11. Come on, Wrath. Good God. Yeah, this is not the draw we were hoping for. Opponent goes attacking. We're going to chump with Thraben Inspector. Down to 8. Obnixilis. Store up mana. Store up mana. And Displacer would have been good a while ago. Well, I mean, I guess we can try it. Eldrazi Displacer, Battlefield Forge. Pass the turn. I mean, we can blink things to stay alive, but... It would have been better when we had, like, Thraben Inspector and so forth. Plus, if they have a removal spell, we're just, like, kind of screwed. Flips Nissa. Well. Let's Blink Tireless Tracker. Take four. Ruinous Path. Yeah, we're getting to the end of our rope here. Nissa gets a grasp of darkness. All right, come on, top of our deck. Well, I guess that keeps us alive temporarily. Back up to nine, get a token, pass the turn. Oh, we just drew too many lands. If we could have had, like, Displacer around with some of our other stuff, things would have been awesome. Are we dead anyway? Yeah, I think so. Opponent gets a land, gets a clue. Yeah, we're dead to clue sacking. Alright. Yeah, that was just epic flood. First game was still sweet though. Uh, I guess the question is, do we want, do we want emulating glare? I think we're fine. Let's just run it back. Oh, uh, would I like to play first? Yeah. Uh, all right. A little slow, but we got some power. See how much we get wrecked by discard. Uh, so planes go. Tap land for our opponent. Uh, planes. And Knight of the White Orchid. I don't think we're going to get a land off it anyway, so we might as well start beating down. Oath of Nyssa for our opponent gets... A Den Protector. And Evolving Wilds. Cracks it. Swamp. Well, Majoring Network, get in with our Knight. Pass the turn. Sylvan Advocate, and Evolving Wilds. Now, store up some mana. Planes, and Archangel of Tithes. Pass the turn. Ruinous Path takes down our Archangel. Another Evolving Wilds. Opponent gets in 4-2. Now, Majoring Network, go. Valving Wilds, cracked. Uh, opponent gets in 4 2. Another land. And Den Protector. Well, store up some mana. Store up some mana. Um, not great. Opponent can get back what? Ruinous Path? Alright, Battlefield Forge, go. Flip 
flips the den protector, gets back Ruinous Path, his Scene Quagmire, kills our knight. Alright, take a bunch. Seven, down to nine. Now, Mage, Majoring Network. Majoring Network. Hollowed Moonlight. Gets another Planes. And another Planes. Alright, play the Planes. Linvala. Gains us some life. Gets us an Angel. Pass the turn. The rest, ugh, that's bad. Now we're back to needing some top decks. And third Ruinous Path. Taking four. Alright, we gotta draw a non-land card of some kind. Another Den Protector. That works. Well, I guess we just gotta fire it off. So Tragic Arrogance, our opponent keeps Oath of Nyssa and Den Protector. We keep the Angel. Um, I think we hold the planes for now in case we draw Myria Shepherd. Lumbering Falls, opponent's last card. Oh, they're just going to Hissing Quagmire. All right, let's... Get rid of Hissing Quagmire. Come on, draw on something. Storage counter. Well, Thraben Inspector. Gets us a clue. Remove storage counters. Add two. Crack the clue. Eh, that's not what we were hoping for. Lumbering Falls. Well, uh, let's jump down to four. Another hissing quagmire. Add a storage counter. Add a storage counter. Pray that we don't draw another land. Uh, all right, this might keep us alive if our opponent does not have removal. So much better if we had something to go with it, though. And our opponent top deck, Grasp of Darkness. Well, Blink the Den Protector. Lumbering Falls is going to put us down to one. So what we really need is a Myria Shepherd, I believe. Opponent's out of cards. They did top deck it, and we're dead. Oh, so frustrating. All right.